doing a flipbook. It's one version of a larger project. It comes from this book. It's 50 years of masking game dance company and almost, so it's a book by David Vaughan, the archivist of the company. And uh, there's 300 pictures in it. Uh, and they are documenting more than 200 projects of Merce Cunningham. The basic idea that we could do a flip book from this book, taking it very seriously as if it was a choreography, that it would start like this, it would end up with this jump, uh, that in the middle we would go through all the pictures. So it's very strange as a choreography, but it's not very far from the Merce Cunningham idea somehow on, in how to build movement. Because he, he was not into organic developments, he was using, let's say, cut up uh, chance reactions to, to choose to select movement's positions. Four, three, two, one, zero. I mean, when we started this project, he was still alive. This is important. He was doing his work in New York, and I was with students in Berlin. It was a wild way to work without him, let's say. To do, uh, we don't have the choreographer, but we work. Okay, we have a book. Let's work from what we have. We have this book. It's a Christmas gift. Can, what can we do? It's, it's just one example of what we could, how to transform a book and maybe archive into something else. No, it, we, we did something very strange in Tate, but I liked it, I enjoyed it. Like we, we invited Valda Shatterfield, so who worked with Mas Cunningham, to be there, to talk to the audience about her own memories. She was part of this project also. And we presented a film where she was dancing. So. And then we would just rehearse, but in front of the visitor. I worked with the Cunningham Company for many, many years. And uh, but when Boris decided to use seven former Cunningham dancers to realize this piece, I was one. I was actually the oldest. This idea of flipping through and finding a way to keep these alive and fluid within each other is, is extraordinary. There does become a kind of movement if you flip fast enough. My own perception is that Merce was not really so interested in, in preservation uh, and that, that Boris has found a way for Merce's work to continue without him uh, and give it new dimensions. Of course, this, this space is very, very specific. I think he, the architecture is really special, and uh, I'm sure it will inspire a lot, a lot of artists. 